What's going on everybody? This is Joshua Davis here with Champions Fishing. I hope that you're doing well today. We're here at the house, so we're about to put together our new Yak Gear Crate. Uh, I bought the Yak Gear Crate yesterday at Bass Pro Shops. It was it was on sale, and so I don't remember exactly what I paid for because I bought a bunch of stuff. But uh, we got this, uh, came with two of these uh, rod holders here, and then it also came, let me reach in here, sorry for my arm in the way there. But uh, it also came with uh, this nice bag, so we'll mount that onto the crate as well. And then, of course, like I said, it came with the two of those rod holders. So we're going to go ahead and put this together. It's a real simple project, not anything major. Uh, to do this, you just need a, you know, you need your drill bit, a 5/32nds bit, screwdriver, pliers, and then you'll need a 3 16 drill bit for the rod, the rod holders itself. So, and then here's the crate. I'll show you here the crate and so this is this is the crate there and so we're gonna go ahead and get this together as soon as I get this together I will come back and do a video just showing it and again I want to appreciate you guys for getting on the channel here uh, we've got 16 subscribers as at the time of this viewing here it's September the 15th I believe or 16th and so we got 16 subscribers we're just a we're a brand new channel just a couple weeks old. We've been doing this all organic, no uh, paid paid marketing or anything like that. So appreciate the love uh, so far, and I appreciate you guys helping us here in the early days as we get off the ground in uh, launching, you know, our ministry here and our uh, our business as well, and on the internet and uh, through YouTube. And I'm really hoping that uh, we make a difference in your life. So stay tuned. Let's get this crate together. All right, guys, back real quick here. We've got the first part of our uh, Yak Gear crate uh, put together here. We've got our bag on the side. I went ahead and done that first. Um, it is a little bit off-centered, as you can see. Um, there's just really um, no way for me to have gotten that center unless I had this bag, like, bulged out here a little bit, like a lot of give in here. And I thought, you know, if I did that, then I would have to mount it somehow here in the center as well but there's just there's not really enough hardware uh for that i mean the rest of the hardware goes for the um the rod holder so um that's just the, well, the lay of the land right now so then the inside here you can see uh, we have these bolts sticking up so what i'll probably do is just take a little hacksaw i wear it and then like the bottoms i had to go in the corner so you see those are angled but i'll just take a little hacksaw and uh, trim those off so that stuff doesn't get caught into it inside. So anyway, I'll be back in a minute after we get the uh, rod holders installed and then we'll show you the finished crate. As we now have the rod holders attached, as you can see here, we've got those screwed in both places. Um, again, the design of this uh, crate would have been a little bit better if, you know, if it was, uh, you know wider like in these areas here where that could have fit better, but it's okay. It works out um, Nothing to complain about we got them here on both sides. So again just show you the inside I did put washers um, on the inside of these here uh, where they were flat and uh, Everything so and then I put the washers on the outside of that there because the ring for this was a lot larger right here let me show you that so anyway um overall great product from yak gear uh thanks for putting it together uh was it worth uh 30 bucks um you know i i guess that's subjective depends on who you ask but uh it's done it took me probably i don't know 10 15 minutes or something most of the time was uh, my analytical mind getting in the way uh, of everything but uh, other than that i mean we're good to go now we have our crate set up uh, if i want to put you know another rod holder here down the road i can if i want to end up putting two more on the back i can do that as well um, i'll probably just stick a little cooler inside of this um to put some you know drinks or something in uh, or maybe i'll set a um a bucket of bait you know if i've got fishing with minnows or something um, I'll just go ahead and put them in the kayak, you know, back here. And then once I get to where I'm sitting at and, and fishing, then pull them out, put them up front with me in the in the uh, cockpit area of the yak. And so, you know, that's it. So 
Yak gear, great product. Everything seems to be made pretty good and sturdy. Got the Velcro handle here. Uh, it's a double Velcro, so you got uh, the Velcro here this way. And then you've got the inside here is Velcroed as well. So, boy, that camera makes my skin look really yellow in the lighting. But anyway, just wanted to uh, show you guys that. And uh, if you have any questions, just let me know. Alright guys, just to wrap up real quick here, uh, we did get the Yak Gear completed there as you saw in the video. And uh, again, thanks Yak Gear for making a, a good product. I think it's a great product. There's some improvements I think engineering that I would have done a little bit different with the design of the crate. Just for the mounting, I probably had some flush mounting surfaces on the outside. Uh, you know, one in each corner. But then again, um... You know, it's a little bit more versatile this way. You're not restricted to only doing where those flush mounts might be, but is that really a big deal after all? So anyway, again, thanks for uh, the great product and the, uh, Bass Pro Shops. Thanks for having this on hand yesterday. A lot of places that I went to yesterday after picking my kayak were out of stuff. So again, um, overall satisfied. Can't wait to put this in the, cat, the kayak and to get the new kayak out of the water and uh, be actually set up to uh, fish out of it. So, again, thanks for getting on the channel. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe. Please share this with your friends as we build up our channel here. Thanks. God bless.